I watched a match, a football match, where a coach was given the privilege to gather the best 11 all over the world. And he succeeded to gather the best 11. Then they brought up a club to play against the best 11. Do you know that I was not disappointed at the outcome of the football match? The best 11 won convincingly. For Nigeria to be great again, do you know where our best 11 are? Now, when I use the word best 11, I'm talking about the people that will fit in every sector. Most of the people that should fit in every sector in Nigeria are out there in the white man's land, working hard, building the white man's economy. Why? The reason is because we have been made to believe that greener pasture is abroad. For Nigeria to be great again, I want us to begin to invest in our talents. Let's begin to invest in the giftings of the gifted. Let's begin to value the people we have. Because the people we refuse to value today in our country are being valued out there in the white man's land. Imagine the number of doctors we graduate every year. From how many are there? How many of them are imputed into our medical or health sector today? Where are they? Most of them are abroad. And if you turn to the right today, it is Jaffa. Turn to the left to tomorrow, Jaffa. Why? They've been made to believe that greener pasture is not heard. But I believe that Nigeria can be great. But for Nigeria to be great again, please, I will want us all to begin to invest our talents. Let's begin to invest our time, invest our resources in our country. I tell you the truth. If we invest what we have here, you will see that investors will begin to come from far. I was privileged to travel out of Nigeria. And one of the things that shocked me was that most of the doctors at the hospitals abroad, I took my time to observe, they are Nigerians. Does that shock you too? Then what about this in the sports sectors? You'll be shocked. In the team of England, we have about two Nigerians that are playing for England. Should we talk about other sectors? You have them in large number. For Nigeria to be great again, let us believe in our country. Let us invest what we have here. Now, if we all decide to invest what we have here, do you know one of the things that it will trigger? It will make us to want to protect our nation. Because a wise man said, as I summarize, put your eggs in one basket. Do your best. Use all you have to protect that basket. Jesus, our Lord, says something I will never forget. He said, where a man's treasure is, what will happen to him? There, his heart will be. If our trend is in Nigeria, I'm telling you the fact, you will see that we will give our best into our nation. Beloved, I am trusting God that men like Rashidi Yekini will arise again in the Nigeria of today. He decided in his days, even when we could not afford to give them a jersey. I read in history that Rashidi Yakini would take his tracksuit and the tracksuit of his uh, other mates, cut it into nika size for them to represent our country. Where is our best level? 
let's start putting our best 11 to work for Nigeria to be great again. Let's take our pledge. I pledge to Nigeria, my country, to be faithful, loyal, and honest, to serve Nigeria with all my strength, to defend our unity, and uphold our honor and glory. So help me God. Thank you.